Well, how y'all doing today? Hope y'all having a blessed day. Let's see what time it is. It's about 8.40 here in Little Rock, Arkansas. And uh, we've been having storms. And I mentioned in another video, the thing that bothered me the most about that was that I missed the lunar eclipse. Tonight is the last night for the lunar eclipse. And it's still cloudy. But that storm... Uh, Ooh, it just, uh, if you had anything on the porch that wasn't secured, it was gone. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so this morning, I'm thinking about breakfast. And I don't usually eat breakfast. I don't usually eat till uh, 12 o'clock. And by then, it's leftovers for the day from the day before. And so, uh, but every once in a while, I get a taste for breakfast. Now, uh... Just because I don't eat breakfast doesn't mean that nobody else does. Uh, with my last husband, he loved grains. And so I would pick up packages of oatmeal. And we were truck drivers, and so I told him, uh, just go in where they make the coffee. There's a spigot for tea. It's hot water. Add it to your oatmeal. And I get him canned fruit and stuff and he would eat breakfast i wasn't big on breakfast but every once in a while i am and when i do uh get that way <laughs> i will fry potatoes uh make biscuits and uh bacon sausage gravy and eggs yeah but also once in a while i like what they call an english breakfast okay a full english breakfast uh, which is eggs, uh, potatoes, uh, braised tomatoes. Now, the first time I ever had braised tomatoes for breakfast was with one of my ex-mother-in-laws. She's gone now, God rest her soul. Uh, she was from England and uh, went out to uh, Virginia uh, to stay where she was and, and meet her and everything. And uh, she made a full English breakfast for us, and she braised tomatoes. First time I had ever had it. It's a wonderful thing. Um, sad to say, in the U.S., a lot of people don't eat vegetables or fruit for breakfast. If you have a glass of tom uh, tomato or uh, orange juice with the pulp in it for breakfast, you're doing good. But in other countries, yeah, they eat a whole lot more of uh, vegetables and fruits for breakfast, which has got to be healthy for you. But when I lived in Quebec and traveling up through Quebec, uh, Quebec, uh, into the woodlands, uh, there was a little mom and pop place where you could get gas. Uh, really, truck drivers really couldn't get gas there, fuel there, I should say. Uh, you always had to make sure you had enough fuel when you were going through some areas. All right, you you fueled up first. And some, you could sleep the night there if you needed to. And uh, we'd go in and get a full breakfast. <coughs> Pardon me. A few, uh, what they call a full English breakfast. Which was eggs. Uh, sausage. What they call bangers. Uh, English call them bangers. Now I have made bangers and beans. Uh, when they have their beans on toast, usually it's pork and beans. It's not baked beans. But at this place, you could get a, a, a little side of baked beans came with it. But they made them themselves, and they were really good. So you got uh, your eggs, you got potatoes, you got uh, braised tomatoes, you got uh, bangers, you got uh, all kinds of stuff came with it. It was called a, a full English breakfast, right? And it was good. It really was. And it was very, very filling. It really was. And I enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that very much. And uh, so today, this morning, I'm thinking about a full English breakfast. <laughs> uh, but I did some serious cooking last night. I made tacos and I had to slice and dice and everything like that. And then we lost power. But at least I got it done before then. And uh, so this mo uh, today, this morning, today, no, I, I don't think I'm going to be cooking that. <laughs> uh, but I have... Um, but uh, I do have a bunch of flour tortillas, and I, and I have some chorizo. And I'm thinking, uh, yeah, breakfast tacos. So, uh, 
but I have a lot to do. Uh, I have some catching up to do and stuff like that. Uh, I've had the privilege of speaking with my son, well, texting with him here uh, lately. He says he's sending something for me. It's supposed to be here today. Uh, that's nice. It really is. Uh, I appreciate my son. I really do. But, unfortunately, it's overcast today and cloudy, very cloudy. And uh, I mentioned this in another video. If any of you uh, can get um, capture the lunar eclipse, which was last night and tonight, and we were without, uh, we were without power yesterday, okay, for about seven hours. Overcast. No way we're going to see the lunar eclipse. And I don't think we're going to today. Uh, but if any of you can, like, wherever you're off, it's nice and clear, you can video it, please put that out there. I'd love to see it. I'm sure a lot of people would. So, uh, I have a trillion things to do today, and uh, it was just, I was just thinking about a full English breakfast, right? I was, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, it sounds good right now. Anyway, uh, y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye. <laughs>